Hello, welcome back to Trailer Trash. Today's trailer is called Winner, featuring Zach Galifianakis. Is now let's let's place our bets now. Is Zach Galifianakis the comedian finally moving on, like most other comedians before him, to serious roles? Can Zach Galifianakis carry a, a drama with just his chops alone? Or is it just another comedy? Let's find out. Trejo's Tacos, Pork Al Pastor. Get two street tacos for $4.99. Danny Trejo created his own taco brand? Huh. I'm more interested in that than the trailer. Dad, get in here! What is going on? To some folks, trying to understand both sides of a conflict. Jesus, I wasn't expecting that. Fuck. <laughs> Again, uh, place your bets. Is this a drama or is this a comedy? But maybe it's a mesh of the two. You can't bet on that, though. That's cheating. Is on American. Trust me, y'all. I'm as American nice. as it gets. Nice. My name is Reality Winner. Yeah, it's my real name. The truth is. Based on reality, that's funny. But her name is Reality. Because remember I said way back when, like, what if... A movie trailer just straight up was like based on actual events but then it's just completely bullshit stuff like why haven't people trailers just done that just to just to fuck with people we're almost there we almost got there whoever the bad guys are okay once you spend some time with them learn their ways gabs a dan has a bonus on i want to help people displaced by war you know what stops wars the u.s air force sorry dude i'm going to a and m so I joined the Air Force. Really? It's a joke, right? Boot camp starts the day after I graduate. And then I was off to Afghanistan. I can't help but notice um, the plot has nothing to do with Zach Galifianakis. So once again, we've been honey dicked by, by a trailer title and, 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 and thumbnail. I, I should start making a tally of how many times we see a thumbnail feature a prominent actor and then watch a trailer that has nothing to do with that fucking actor. Uh, Sky Captain. Was that, wasn't that the thing? Like, the trailers showed Angelina Jolie, like, everywhere, but she's in, like, one scene in the movie. Like, I, did we learn nothing from that? Yeah, I wish. They said I had to start here first, doing surveillance on the Taliban. <laughs> the next two years were all drone strike in Bamiyan, road trip with Andre, bench 130, killed someone's grandfather, dude moved into my place, killed three ISIS dudes, $500 to the Red Cross, saw Pitch Perfect 2, better than Pitch Perfect 1. Wonder if they'll make it a trilogy. <laughs> so it's funny, but it's also a biopic. Um, that's interesting. I mean, this, this reality person, if that is her real name, <laughs> led a very interesting life. But uh, I've said it before and I'll say it again. And I'm sorry, but I didn't know it was a biopic going into it. So I just got to bring it up again. It's less than half of it's going to be true. My job is to monitor the running aerospace. Everything else is need to know. What if I need to know who got eliminated on The Bachelorette? Not on office computers. But you can come ask me. I keep up. I mean, you'd at least want to look, right? Be honest. The government 100% knew the Russians hacked their voting systems days before the election. We received a report that you mishandled some classified information. Crazy. Were you aware that your daughter hates America? My daughter isn't a terrorist. If no one ever takes a risk to try and change things, then nothing will ever change. Uh, note Zach Galifianakis' name, very bottom of the list. Who's on the thumbnail? What was that? Oh, is Zach Gal? Who was the first name after the the title of the the movie? Is Zach Galifianakis? Oh, weird, weird. I fucking hate that shit. Anyway, really nothing to say. I can't speculate on plot or uh, uh, anything else really because again, less than fifty percent of it's probably bullshit just for the sake of. Oh, 
Hollywood. So let's check out the comments. Anyone else have a heart attack and thought that thumbnail was Robin Williams? I miss him. Weird. Don't give Hollywood ideas. They're going to have Zach Galifianak fuck play a Robin Williams in a biopic. <laughs> watch it'll happen thought that oh sorry to bot that thumbnail was russell crowe why why do you know why does nobody think it's zach galifianakis and some other actor they literally looked at the title of the 2023 20, movie reality starring sydney sweeney and decided since that movie used her first name they would use her last name the originality is mind-blowing yeah people kept mentioning a movie called reality with so her name is reality winner I would believe Zach Galifianakis was her father. <laughs> yeah, Sydney Sweeney already did it. So this this was already a movie. This story was already told. And apparently, according to one comment... Oh, never mind. I thought they mentioned the, the year it came out. But yeah, it's, it already happened. We already had this story told. So why is it being told again? I'm confused by this. And what, what big-named actor played her dad in that one and was thrown all over the, the thumbnail and title and shit to make people actually interested in seeing it i wonder i thought i saw a movie about her already but it was not a comedy is the iraq war now a comedy yeah that's the other interesting thing i mean i was kind of joking i don't know i'm kind of with gilbert Gottfried on this like at what point is 9 11 too soon but at the same time yeah it's kind of tasteless depending on how you frame it obviously um but that's all the opinion that doesn't mean anything but uh it is very strange that it's you know a comedy and and apparently a, a comedic a comedic telling of this person's life and they went to war after 9 11 <laughs> like hilarious you could put a comedic spin on anything just look at rock the casbah that in in essence wasn't really a comedy but bill murray is still a charismatic enough guy to make it you know i guess charming maybe it wasn't funny it was just he had a lot of charm to it but yeah the rest of the comments isn't really much to talk about a lot of it is uh politically motivated and this is a trailer video i'm not i'm not getting into that shit um but it's obviously a politically motivated i guess movie so it makes sense that people would bring those opinions to the comment section but it kind of kind of brings down what i'm trying to do here uh, uh but yeah i don't know it's apparently already been done go check out reality i guess instead of winner if you want a more dramatic version of it still not accurate but you know, dramatic instead of comedic if you like zach galifianakis you know watch the hangover <laughs> don't fucking watch this uh but yeah that'll that'll be it for today's trailer trash i can't really think of anything to say to make it more interesting of a video so fuck me <laughs>